Okay. Hey, history buffs, and welcome to this date in American Indian history, December 24th. Ooh. Are you anxious for Christmas? Do you open presents tonight? Do you do presents? Hmm, good question. Do you go, are you, if you're... Uh, should we talk religion? Because I was going to say, do you go to church? Because I know I grew up in a, I went to a Catholic school, so we had to go, well, not we had to, well, my family had to go because I was in the choir. and I sang, yeah, with this voice, with this gravelly voice, I sang until my eighth grade teacher told me I was tone deaf. But like through the rest of my schooling though, I was singing at church, choir. Oh, those were the good old days. I don't know. That's what, Maybe that's why I don't know any carols in English. So anyway, I hope you um, go out there and have a really... I don't know what I'm trying to say. Let's just get on to the day, the state in history, December 24th. The year is 1880. Crow King went to Fort Buford for Sitting Bull. It's really interesting when you're when you're reading all of these different years in history because they kind of all mesh together at some point. Because didn't we just like a couple weeks ago that we were talking about going to secure Sitting Bull and then the next day like he was dead. But they were if you look at the years they were totally different years apart. So it's really hard when you're looking at a history book like this that's just by years to kind of get a broad spectrum of you know when things happened. So I guess I'm learning, uh, you know, little bits and pieces, and uh, it'll all come together at some point, right? But go out there, sing a few Christmas carols, open a few presents, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. It's not going to be early, because we don't do early on Christmas morning, so I'm just saying. We'll see you later. Go out there and make your own history. Off, off, off.